Tomorrow, North Dakota will elect a new governor and decide on a U.S. House and U.S. Senate race. Valley News Team's Ethan Kramer sat down with all these candidates mm -hmm. this election season to see why they should get your vote. With just one day to go until Election Day, voters will head to the polls tomorrow to cast their vote for president. But also here in North Dakota, voters will vote on the race for governor, House and Senate. Now, I sat down with all the candidates running for those positions in our Valley News Live studios, and I got their explanation on why they should get your vote. I think the single biggest answer is I absolutely love this state. I have been blessed to live here. I've been blessed to grow up here. I've been blessed to raise my family here. That when you when you go into that voting booth, it's just you and that ballot in front of you, and you can vote for whoever you want. And I, I firmly believe we have a very trustworthy election system here in North Dakota. And I'm just asking for their vote. When voters go to the booth on November 5th, they have a choice between a trained problem solver. I have three patents. I've worked in industry. I've worked in education. And I've always been there for them. I always put the, the communities and the citizens of North Dakota first in every decision that I make. To really roll up my sleeves and try to get to work and pro provide the conservative solutions to a lot of these big problems that I believe North Dakotans know exist and, and want in their leaders. So I hope that they will see that in me. As a bonus, you know, you send me as a Democrat to the U.S. House, I have a lot of leverage in the Democratic Party there. I can turn things North Dakota's way because they are going to want to try to keep me there. Now tomorrow to keep up to date with the current poll numbers, you can download the free VLNL News app on your phone, but you can also head to our website at valleynewslive.com to check the current updates on all the races throughout the state. In Fargo, Ethan Kramer, Valley News Live. Now, there haven't been many polls of North Dakota, but the ones we have seen show Armstrong, Kramer, and Fedorchak with comfortable leads, the Republicans, which would mean a clean sweep for the GOP.